Friends, all right, I'm with Gage here and Eric, other Eric, who was here last week with us. And uh, Don't Eric's. Roxy. Yeah, and Roxy. Where's Roxy? Mm. Bring Roxy. All right, today we're going to be talking about Bret Hart versus Kurt Angle, a uh, dream match that me and Gage thought of. Uh, uh, I would have to personally go for Kurt Angle because, you know, he was in the Olympics and won the gold medal with the broken neck. So I would have to give it to Kurt Angle because he's a better technical wrestler than Bret Hart. Okay. So what do you think about Bret Hart then? Um, well, Bret Hart was a four-time WWE champion. Um, one of like the best there is, the best there was, the best there ever will be. And uh, you know, Bret Hart. I'm gonna get that. Uh, do you have his DVD yet? On DVD, his Bret Hart DVD. Yeah, I have it. You got it? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. No, I'm kidding. Oh. Because I would have like freaking stole it from you. Yeah, no, but, I'm just kidding. I don't yeah, steal. but my cousins have the Bret Hart video. They do. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. All right, so Bret Hart, four-time WWE champion, beat Shawn Michaels. Uh, him and Shawn Michaels actually had a really big feud back in the day, and um, you know Bret Hart was like actually probably the best wrestler in, in like that time. Do you agree? Mm-hmm. Probably was because um, he wasn't just like the best. He was. He lived the best. He proved that he was the best. And, uh, you haven't, you know Bret Hart? Yeah, I know who it is. Yeah, but then he had his downfall and then went to WCW, remember? Yeah. When he got screwed on the day Shawn Michaels put the sharpshooter on Bret Hart, then Mr. McMahon, uh, Yeah, I know, and then he actually got really pissed. And, like, he was yes. He spat on his face, and later on, he actually got in a fight with them backstage. And, and he punched uh, him in the face. That's why they, you know, that's why he never came back for a WWE for a while. But... Kurt Angle, I think he's the better wrestler because, you know, he's been in the Olympics. And uh, he's doing really good in WWE and TNA. He's won a lot of championships there. And uh, he's being The Rock, Triple H. He's beating... John Cena. He beat John Cena yeah. on his debut. And that was probably why I think Kurt Angle could beat him. I think he would probably beat Bret Hart with the ankle lock and make him tap out. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's a submission guy versus a submission guy. I mean, you got Bret Hart, you know... Amazing, outstanding wrestling. Um, you, he used to be like he used to be like the face of the WWE, but until like The Rock and Stone Cold were there. But yeah, um, you know Shawn Michaels and um, Bret Hart were never really big of friends like back then. I I guess they're kind of friends, but they don't really talk to each other. They're not friends. They actually just they're really different. They they don't like their uh, personality. And so they're they're okay right now, but you know they still don't really like each other. Yeah, but you know Kurt Angle. Yeah, I think he would beat Bret Hart for sure. That's what I'm thinking. All right, so guys, tell us what you think. Uh, let us know in the comments. Uh, dream. We if we get ideas, that'd be great. Like, give us some ideas on who you want to see next. Tell me what you think about this match. Who do you think would win? Uh, anything else, Gabe? Nope, there's nothing else. Anything else, Eric? No. Who'd you go for, Eric? Bret Hart. Bret Hart or Kurt Angle? Probably Angle. Angle, yeah, see, you're, you're a lone person. Uh, no, I'm, I'm pretty sure that my subscribers are going to say uh, Bret Hart. No, no. Yeah. go for Kurt Angle. Bret Hart. All right, see you guys later. See you guys. Y'all guys done? Y'all guys done? Yeah, yeah, we're done. All right.